Hello students, welcome to our channel Learning Notebook. It is always fun to learn maths through activities. So today we have come up with an interesting and creative activity for you to find factors of any number. But before starting with this video, let me tell you that we have made many more maths art integrated activities, projects and working models on our channel Learning Notebook. You can find the list of all such videos on our website as well. The link to our website is below in the description box. For this activity, we need few colorful thick sheets, a ruler, a black marker pen, a pencil and a pair of scissors. Aim of this art integrated project is to understand what are factors and then we learn how to find factors of any given number with the help of this interesting activity. If you have not subscribed to our channel, then do subscribe our channel Learning Notebook and make sure to press the bell icon. So let's start and first understand what is multiple. The product of two or more numbers is the multiples of the numbers that are being multiplied. Let's understand it with the help of an example. 6 multiplied by 5 equals to 30. So here the product 30 is the multiple of 6 and it is also the multiple of 5. Let's take another example. 2 into 4 into 5 equals to 40. Here, product 40 is the multiple of 2. It is the multiple of 4 and 40 is also the multiple of 5. So, remember that the product of 2 or more numbers is the multiples of the numbers that are being multiplied. Now let's understand what are factors. When two or more numbers are multiplied, each of the numbers being multiplied is called the factor. Let's consider a few examples. 3 multiplied by 7 equals to 21. So here students, we have learned that 21 is a multiple of 3 and 7. Also, 3 and 7 are factors of 21. Let's take one more example. 2 into 3 into 5 equals to 30. So, 30 is a multiple of 2, 3 and 5. And remember that 2, 3 and 5 are factors of 30. So, when two or more numbers are multiplied, each of the numbers being multiplied is called the Factor. Now let's see what are prime numbers. Numbers with only two factors, one and itself, are called prime numbers. For example, two. It has only two factors, one and the number two itself. Therefore, 2 is a prime number. Similarly, number 3. Again, it has only two factors, 1 and 3 itself. So, 3 is also a prime number. Now, let's see number 4. Number 4 has three factors, 1, 2 and 4. Therefore, it is not a prime number. Number 4 is a Composite number. Students, 
we have got separate videos on complete chapter of multiples and factors for class 4, class 5 as well as for class 6. I am sure all your doubts related to these topics would be resolved after watching these comprehensive videos. You will find their links below in the description box. Now, let's start with our activity. In the first step, take a red sheet of paper and draw small circles on it as shown here. Then, carefully cut out these circles using pair of scissors. So, we have cut out these red coins. And we are going to use them to find factors of 12. To find factors of 12, let's take 12 coins. And we will try to arrange these coins in rows in such a way that each row has the same number of coins. So first let's arrange these coins in one row. So we are arranging all the 12 coins in one row. Students, this arrangement of coins can be expressed as 1 into 12. Next, let's arrange these coins in two rows. So, here each row has 6 coins. This arrangement of coins can be expressed as 2 into 6. If you still have not subscribed to our channel, then do subscribe our channel Learning Notebook and make sure to press the bell icon. Then we will arrange these coins in 3 rows. So it means each row has 4 coins and this arrangement of coins can be expressed as 3 into 4. Next, we will arrange these coins in 4 rows. So each row has got 3 coins. So this arrangement can be expressed as 4 into 3. But students, we have already covered it as 3 into 4 arrangement. So, it means we have to stop here. So, now students, we have got four arrangements. First arrangement is 1 into 12. Second arrangement is 2 into 6. Third is 3 into 4. And fourth is 4 into 3. But, we have already covered 4 into 3 as 3 into 4. So it means we will not consider this fourth arrangement. Now let's write factors of 12 using these three arrangements. We will start from top to bottom. The factors of 12 are 1, 2, 3. Now, we will write from bottom to top, 4, 6 and 12. So, this is how we can find factors of 12 with the help of this interesting activity. Students, we would like to tell you that we have made videos on every chapter of class 4, class 5 and class 6 mathematics. We also have related worksheets, quizzes, working models, activities and projects on each chapter. So I would recommend you to check out our channel Learning Notebook. Now let's find factors of 24. 
So to find factors of 24, let's take 24 coins. And again, we will try to arrange these coins in rows in such a way that each row has the same number of coins. First, let's arrange these 24 coins in one row. So, we have arranged all the 24 coins in one row. This arrangement of coins can be expressed as 1 into 24. Now, let's arrange these 24 coins in 2 rows. So, each row has 12 coins. So, this arrangement can be expressed as 2 into 12. Next, we will arrange these coins in 3 rows. So, each row has got 8 coins. And this arrangement of coins can now be expressed as 3 into 8. Then we will arrange these 24 coins in 4 rows. So each row has got 6 coins. And we can write this arrangement as 4 into 6. Now students, let's try to arrange these 24 coins in 5 rows. We see that each row does not have same number of coins. So we will not consider this arrangement. Next, we will arrange these 24 coins in 6 rows. So each row has got how many coins? 4 coins. So this arrangement can be expressed as 6 into 4. But students, we have already covered it as 4 into 6. So we will stop here. Students, so now we have got 5 arrangements. First arrangement is 1 into 24. Second arrangement is 2 into 12. Third is 3 into 8. Fourth one is 4 into 6 and last one is 6 into 4. But we have already covered it as 4 into 6. So we will not consider this fifth arrangement. Now let's write factors of 24. We will start from top to bottom. 1, 2, 3, 4. Now write from bottom to top. 6, 8, 12 and 24. So these are factors of 24. Now in the end I am giving you a worksheet for your practice. Students, using this activity, you have to find the factors of following numbers 15, 27, 28 and 33. I am sure you enjoyed this interesting and creative activity. Do watch my other videos and share my channel and my videos with your friends and family. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.